Hey everyone, welcome back to the channel. Thanks for tuning in again. I'm gonna go over a little video on the 23 Frontier Pro 4X here because I do follow a couple groups on Facebook of the Nissans, this is a third gen, about the gas fuel door. Basically, the fuel door doesn't close tight up against the vehicle. It's a simple fix. Most likely your issue might not be 100% of the vehicles, but from what I could see, most of them are fixed using this method. So we'll flip it around right away, show you exactly what I'm talking about, and I'll show you how easy it is to fix it yourself. Okay, so we are working with a 2023 Frontier Pro 4X, but this is any 2022 and up Frontier vehicle, doesn't re matter. Regardless of the trim, this is an issue that I've seen happen on a few trucks, and that is when you close the fuel door, you can see mine closes and she's nice and snug up against the body like it should be. Weird thing is, this doesn't click closed. I know my front or my Pathfinder is a 2018. You kind of close the door and you give it a click and it locks it. This truck, on the other hand, doesn't have that. And what a few people I've seen have issues with is when you close the door, it gets stuck open about that far. And not only does it look stupid when you're walking by the vehicle, but when you're driving around and you look in your rear view mirror, you can actually see this thing open and it's just an eyesore. It looks dumb, especially on a brand new truck. You don't want to be having issues like this. And simple fix, what it is, is if you open this up and you come in here, it also has a actual gas cap still. A lot of them go to capless now, but this one has a fuel cap. And what it is, is this wire moves. Obviously, you take your fuel cap off and some people just let it hang by the truck, but they have this little thing here. You can hang your fuel cap like that off the cable so it's not hanging on the side of your truck, banging around, making it gross and all that stuff. So when you're done that, people come back in here Put your fuel cap back on, give it that click. Now I have mine put properly. You can see it comes up and around this way. But when I first got the truck, I did have the issue where when you close the door, it wouldn't stay tight. So I was thinking maybe throwing a magnet on both sides or something just to give it an extra little oomph to keep it closed. But when I came to look in here a little bit closer and you can maybe tell now this has a little bit of a kink here and there. That's because this was around the other way, like so, and the cable was actually getting pulled. I know it's kind of dark. I'll get a light out for you guys. So maybe you can see a little better now with the light on, but basically the cable was up against the little latch there on, or the hinge on your gas cap, or fuel door, sorry. And when it closed and opened, it would close like so. You can see that thing gets pulled into the truck, hides away, and it was actually pulling the little cable that holds your fuel cap from flying away in with it. So with the extra space in there, when it closed, instead of that thing having the room it's supposed to have to just come closed, the cable was hitting the end of it and it would stop it, like I said, just about there. So if you're having this issue, open it up. Just make sure this thing is not tucked in here. Like I said, pull it out, twist it, and keep the actual part that's holding the cap up to the top and to the back of your vehicle. And then you can see it just tucks around nicely like so. And when you close her up, she stays nice and tight. So there you have it guys, a nice, quick, easy fix. Like I said, it was the issue on my truck along with a few other guys that I've talked to on the Facebook groups. It might not be everybody's case. There's a chance that maybe the door just doesn't want to stay closed. I know the few guys that run their trucks through car washes and stuff, because there is no actual latch or any form of anything to keep that closed, car washes and stuff blow the door open. So. If that's your issue, you can find a little magnet or Velcro or anything to give it an extra little bit of support closed. But if you're like me and it's just not closing on its own, chances are something's stuck in there. Having said that, it might not be the wire. It could be like a leaf, 
some sort of dirt. Anything that might have got stuffed in there is going to block that thing. So take a look at it. Your finger fits in. Just feel around in there. Make sure nothing's blocked. And I'm sure that will fix your problem. So hopefully this helped you guys out. Give a thumbs up. Share the video. Subscribe. And hopefully we'll catch you guys in the next video. Thanks for watching.